Oh my gosh! Gosh! Wow! That was amazing! I wasn't even watching the camera, I was just watching you. Eric Kinslow, congratulations, you are alive. For a moment there, somebody thought that you might not have been, because if that torpedo of a skateboard would have came down on any part of your head, you'd have been just donezo, okay? Not even just skating, you'd have been done with so many things. Like, you probably wouldn't have washed your hair that night, you wouldn't have went on that date the next day, okay? You just would have been done. You'd been like one, one Crayola crayon that got broken in half at Frisch's. Because you know that happens at Frisch's, at Big Boy, whatever restaurant you go to, they, you know, they break crayons. So Eric Kinslow was almost a broken crayon, but he did—he succeeded at not dying. Which is a plus, because I like Eric Kinslow. He's like one of those dudes, and I'm like, you know what? You're a funny dude, and uh, I'm, I'm glad you're alive. Now that I think about it, I don't actually tell people that I'm glad they're alive as, as often as I should. So Brian... I'm glad you're alive, buddy. Thanks, buddy. Yeah, that's right. Brian's kind of like the Mr. Wilson of this video. He's just always right there. But seriously, that is a horrifying moment. Everyone has it when their skateboard flies in the air and you're like, it, it is above me and I have no idea where it's going to land. Oh my... And somehow my whole entire life, the board has never struck me, like in, in this instance. It's just how Eric got lucky. I've been lucky my entire life. And uh, I'm happy for all you people that have not gotten hit. Congratulations, we're friends. And all the people that have gotten hit, I'm still your friend, but you know, like we're in a different circle. And you're in like a more manlier circle than me because that would just, that's something to take. That's a war wound, my friend. But of course, as every Fall Friday goes, it did not stop Eric from landing it. He got up and he jumped across the gap and he landed and rolled away. And you're about to watch that right now. Oh, yeah, let's do a blood to Frank around. Oh, I'm coming. Dude, good job. I tried to do the little fake afterwards like you wanted, but I wasn't going fast enough. Okay, yeah. Congratulations, Eric. You're not dead and you land your trick. It's just a good day. I hope you went to Skyline afterwards and got some freaking food. Okay? Or Grater's ice cream. I don't know. Wherever you're gonna go, I hope you went there and rewarded yourself. And if not, I will. So next time you're with me, be like, Andy, buy me something. I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna buy you something because you, you're a double doer. Okay? You, you freaking survived and you landed your trick. But this is actually um, from a video over on Sam's channel. They were filming an Ollie's edit and uh, I believe he posted it. So uh, go over to Sam's channel. The link's right down the info and check out the full edit of Eric and Sam goofing off at uh, Ollie's. Uh, it's always a good time with those guys, and uh, that's just it. I do Fall Fridays about every other week, so in two weeks, we'll see another Fall Friday from me. I hope you dug this one, and uh, I do videos every single day, so stay tuned, subscribe if you're not already subscribed to me, or uh, I don't know, do, do something. Go watch the Discovery Channel. It's fascinating. Either way, I'm going to go, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Brian Ames, take it away. Wait, wait. you going to shoot me? Get it. We hit the lens. Ready? One, two, three. Right. Boom! Did you I do got it? it. There, I got it. Did you do it? Yeah, I did. We'll slow-mo it. Done skating, you'd have been done. He probably wouldn't have eaten. He probably wouldn't, dude. I got some air. <laughs> that was perfect. That was. Uh, it was natural. Oh, it was perfect, dude. I do. I, it was. Per I hit you right here. It was perfect. I know. I felt it, Brian. I was. I was the hitty. Okay. I got. I got hit.